Ten years ago, I was in fifth gear, professionally, personally, cruising. And I had an injury that rocked my world. It taught me that a life-altering event is not the end. Learning how to move ahead, for the most part, was an adventure. And cooking became a way for me to share my best self with others. And I believe that that's a recipe that others can use. <laughs> Good Patty. morning. Good morning, Chip and Joanna. Greetings from Waco, Texas. Greetings from Southwest Montana, Bozeman area. Oh, dude, sounds like a dream. Man, we love a... your kitchen. We were just staring at all the details. Yeah, that's a oh, cool thanks. That's so drop. cool. This kitchen was a chef's dream of putting in a wood-burning hearth and a pizza oven and wow. a hood and a root cellar right underneath here. And so kind of the whole vision for this place is food gets grown outside, gets processed, stored, and then recooked again. Gosh, sounds magical. Eduardo, it's sounds a like a dream. And I think you're the spear of this kind of movement towards a real sustainable food source. Well, first of all, it's not just me. My, my wife's right here. I'd love to introduce you <laughs> at some point. Tell Becca, her to pop in. Hey, we, 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 we got nothing but time. <laughs> hi, guys. Hi. hi. How you doing? Good. How are you guys? Good. You were lovely. How in the world did he rope you into this <laughs> lifestyle? Uh, Email at 1 a.m. <laughs> ah, I always heard nothing good happened at 1 a.m., <laughs> uh, but it turns out maybe that's not true in y'all's case. I know. The email was about eggs and chickens and hiking, oh so goodness. I was hooked. We feel so honored because I'd say a couple years ago, we first saw you in the magazine, The Modern Huntsman, and read yeah. every, every word, word. Yes. just completely totally captivated. captivated by your story. And one quote that hit me like a ton of bricks was this idea that after you uh, encountered that electrical source on that uh, hunting expedition and then lost your arm, you said, even though it was so traumatic and it was so life-changing, and I wouldn't wish it on my worst enemy, I wouldn't go back and change it for myself because of all the things that you learned about yourself through that experience. And it's just so encouraging, man. Thank you. Yeah, so then when the network came along, we were like, can you guys reach out to Eduardo, <laughs> see what he's doing? Um, so tell me about the show and what your hope is with that. When it comes to the Eduardo Garcia Project, WT working title, whatever it's called, you know, <laughs> It's neat, right? Because this is 10 years later. Nothing in my life would be the same or as it was after that injury. Sure. And part of my story is told through food. I've got this love of how it connects with others and how it truly is the fuel in all parts of our tank. And cooking did not save my life, but it became a language for me to share my spark. And so that's where the premise of launch a TV show to have a platform to share the message with others. And, and then this last part of it is I've also realized that to stay quiet is the most unhealthy thing I can do. You know, it's really refreshing to hear someone else's story of how they made it through some adversity. And I find that when I get to speak with someone who's willing to share about their unique experience, that's like incredibly powerful. And so with the TV show, I get to continually be refreshed even myself that life is good, here we are, we can do this. Every day an opportunity, exactly. The way that you are living life is so inspiring. And to yeah. me, what you can teach all of us in the simplicity of just life and learning and kind of just back to the basics. I, there's something about that I just feel like we all need to kind of, mm. you know, tap Spirit. into that. and. We're just excited about starting to see this thing roll out. Absolutely. So excited. so excited about the future with you two in it. We've got your back and we want you two to be a big part of this network and what we're trying to accomplish here. So stick with us and we'll learn together and uh, tell some great stories along the way. Great. Thanks guys. That's Bye, my double thumbs up. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs>